Hey everyone, how's it going? I'm Celeste, I'm your host, and this is Sidekicks Week, and welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Card Openings. I am so excited to be in my little setup. I have my Secret Lab gaming chair here. Um, we are in my new apartment. I'm gonna be decorating this wall so we have a nice little backdrop. Um, as soon as I get like the rest of this setup, I'm gonna get like a little monitor with like an actual camera so I can upgrade from my cell phone. I'm so excited. Big things are coming, but for now I just wanted to get another episode filmed. Um, and a, what better way to celebrate a new start in a new place than with some celebration. So we are gonna go ahead and get this going, get this ETV opened. Um, and then uh, I think I showed you in my last video, I found this really, really cool um, binder that has like all the things I thought would be perfect for celebrations. Um, so we're gonna put the master set uh, together as well. Um, I'm really excited, so let's go ahead and get started. All right, so we're attempting to test a new setup. I'm not sure this is the uh, final uh, setup. Actually, I know this is not the final setup, but um, I do think it's gonna be fun to have like a little bit of a different view for this for now. Um, so we have our book. Um, I'm super interested in knowing what all the cards are and this way we can definitely make sure we have them all checked off. I'm pretty sure we have most of them, if not all of them, but the, this is my favorite part of the ETBs is having the entire book to look through and just check them off, see what we have in here. So we are definitely gonna use that while we're building our master set, but. Let's just go ahead and get right into this box. So of course we have our player's guide, our dice and our damage counters, um, which you know I don't really use, but I really think it would be fun to learn how to play the TCG. So I might actually try to do that here. Um, all right, so then of course we have our block of energy cards. Oh, we got a Greninja promo. That's cool, I didn't know that was in there. Very neat, nice and sealed. We got, of course, our code card. Thank you for watching. And then these lovely um, card sleeves with the 25th on the back, so that is really cool. And it looks like we have quite a selection in here. Of course, the divider, so we're gonna just put all this back in here get out of the way for now. Put that off to the side. Um, all right, so I'll put you up here because you're pretty cool. Our energies we don't need right now. The celebrations we're gonna save for the end. So we're gonna sort all that out right now. They're all just kind of mixed in there, but we got a good uh, collection of other cards as well. Um, so we'll just go ahead and we'll start with Darkness of Blaze. Let's get a Charizard, you know, that would be ideal. That would be freaking ideal, but okay. This is, I'm so excited. Oh, there, look, did you see that? It's not a Charizard, but it is shiny here in the back. All right, so we know this one's already a, a banger. So we're just gonna zip through this. We've all seen Darkness Ablaze, but oh, look at the Torchic, Aeron. Bass. What a problem child that Pokemon was. I did get it evolved though. That was a good day um, in my Pokemon Go. All right, so we have this reverse Kangaskhan. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Oh, look at that Grimstall VMAX. Okay, that is really shiny. We love it. First pack magic, there we are. All right, we're gonna put these off to the side. And let's open Battle Styles next. Oh my goodness. All right, we are off to a great start here. I'm really excited to open this Celebrations, obviously, because that's what the main event is for today's video. We're just going to Single Strike Mustard. Mm. Wonder if he has a ketchup companion. Haha. Uh -huh. <laughs> I'm sorry guys, I couldn't resist. <laughs> I, I'm having a good time already. All right, we got a clay doll for our reverse. And, ooh, a drumpa for the regular rare. 
Don't unfollow me, please. I love you guys. Your support is what keeps me going. I am pretty corny though, so you do have to endure the occasional bad joke. All right, we have four to the front. We are just gonna get through these again. Nothing too crazy. That Porygon is cute though. Uh, Sneasel, Rapid Strike, Snover Single Strike. A lot of variety here. A Cybold for the reverse. Oh, and an Agron for the regular beer. All right. Let's do our Vivid Voltage, and then we'll pull a Charizard from Darkness Ablaze, and then we'll open up the rest of our, the rest of our Celebration Packs. That's, that's what I'm thinking. I hope that sounds good to you. So, manifest some Charizard from the Charizard Art Pack here. That's, that's the goal. Oh, look at that Shuckle. He's so cute. I love him. Okay, execute. Eevee, there we go. We love an Eevee to match our mat. We'll put our Eevee here. Ooh, a fan fee for the reverse. And a Dawn fan, look, it's the evolution chain. That's my favorite. I love when that happens, so cool. Awesome, you guys can live right up there in the, our, you know, money spots. All right. Let's go ahead. We're going to open up this Darkness Ablaze. We're just diving right in. Oh, we got a white code card. We have a white code card. Let me just tell you. This is going to be it. I'm going to be careful with it because Charizard's in here. Oh, we got a fire energy. I don't know how many more signs we need here. I think, I think we're going to pull something special. Oh, we got two of the uh, monkeys, the, the elemental monkeys, Corpus Squire, oh, and a rickety, look, another evolution chain. Like, guys, let me, I told you this pack was gonna be fire. Whew. Here we go. Oh my gosh, I'm <laughs> so nervous. <laughs> okay, that's just the reverse, it's Electrike. We love, we love, what are we gonna, Okay, I'm not. I'm not gonna cheat. I'm just gonna. Oh, it's a heat trip, man! If it had, if I had seen the red border, I would have been really freaking out. But heat tran holographic. I will not complain. That is a beautiful card. Nice little hollow pattern in there. It was not, unfortunately, a Charizard. But we did get our evolution chain out of that, so you know it was. It was still a good pack. All right, now we're gonna just. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me. We saw our good pulls from. The regular cards, Evie, I'm gonna ask you to leave as well because we are moving on over to our celebrations pack, all from this ETB. This was the main event. I don't remember the uh, the card trick for these. It has been way too long since I have opened some celebrations. And I also don't remember if uh, they have different colored code cards, but I am gonna give that one to you guys. Thank you for watching. I hope you get something good. Let me know. I want to know what you're getting from the code cards if you're using them. I'm just gonna flip them over and we'll see what it is and then we can... Okay, so it looks like the last one might be the uh, the heavy hitter. And we got a Zamazenta in this one, a Groudon, a Xerneas, and a Kyogre. These guys obviously rivals, but looking good together. It's got like couple spots right on his belly. I don't know if that's uh, how that card is supposed to be or not. But uh, yeah, we got some nice pulls right from there. All of these beautiful, shiny, holographic cards. So we are going to just put them down and just go through these. I'm super excited to open these cards. They always make me feel so happy. You get all these holographic cards. Ooh, another Kyogre, another Xerneas, Groudon, and a Mew! We got a Mew! Look at that! So cute! This is... I know I say that I have a lot of favorite sets, but I really, 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 really actually like Celebrations a lot. Definitely up there. Um, oh, don't throw that one away. <laughs> Some of my favorites. Cosmog, another Kyogre. 
another Xerneas, and a Pikachu! We love the Pikachu! I love this extended art of like the original card. So cool. He's got his little red cheeks. Super cute. We love Pikachu. I will pull those all day. Like, I think that's one of my favorite cards from this set. All right, oh, we got a Cosmoem. Is that how you say that? Oh, we got him in the same pack. That's what we like. A Claydol and another Mew. You guys can have this code card as well. Thanks for watching. Oh, I almost picked up my other cards and threw them. I forgot what I was doing for a second. Glad we didn't do that. We're not trying to throw all our cards on the floor. Not today. Oh, we got a Reshiram. So that's a new one from, oh, oh. Oh, it's just edgeware. I was like, is there a card stuck to it? But it's just like the holographic borders coming through. And Zekrom, so those guys are the rivals. Another Cosmonom and another Zamazenta. Woohoo! Lots of shield doggos. We need a sword doggo now. Complete that little group. Da, da, da. Okay, here we go. We got another Reshiram, another Zekrom. <gasps> Rocket Zapdos! Look at that hollow! Whoa, it's so cool! Oh man, that's awesome! And then a Professor's Research, which I know I have a ton of those from my other openings. Because um, I found those so that we can put all of these in the binder together in one spot. Um, Gonna be a nice little collection honestly i found um i think i want to put my mcdonald's ones in there as well but i'm not 100 percent sure we have our grout on oh and another pikachu look at that so cool all right we need a hole oh see this guy has like splatter too i don't remember is that what those cards are supposed to look like with like the holographic splatter I don't remember. We'll look at the ETB book here in a second. We got our Reshiram. We got another Grout. There's the ho oh. See, his feathers, I got it too. So it must be part of the thing because it's so consistent. <gasps> and a surfing Pikachu! Oh my gosh, yes. Look at all these beautiful cards. All right, we have two packs left and then we can build the master set. We are doing so good. Looking really good. Oh my goodness. We got another Lugia. We got another Big Bird. Ooh, and we got something in the back there too. I don't know why I tried to flip those over. Ooh, a Dialga. Nice. <gasps> Look at the Red Claws. Whoa! Love it. So pretty. And there's the Zacian. Okay. Nice. We got both of the doggos. We got lots of flying sky monsters. We're doing really good here. We are doing really, really good. Okay, this is our last pack. We have another Kyogre, another Xerneas, another Lugia. Ooh, and a Lunala. Okay, so that's the first time we've got this one from this pack. But that is gonna wrap it up for the pack, so let's go ahead and build master set with our new binder so we can open this up just kidding where is okay so we're back and i just got some scissors to get this open that's all we needed now we have this beautiful binder Ugh, i'm so happy that i found this it's so nice and pristine got the nice side entries and no binder rings, which we love. We want to keep our cards safe and protected. Okay, and then we're going to go back to this guy and put all of our cards in order since they're not like numbered on the card set. And this is going to be a challenge because I have, um, this whole stack from the uh, other box we got that had the card, the gold cards in it. So I'm gonna put those in there as well at some point. <sighs> I have a ton of repeats, obviously, because this is a very small set, 
but uh, we're gonna go ahead and looks like Ho'o is up first. So we will start there. Ho'o. Reshiran. This is a challenge. I wish they were like numbered. That would make things very much more easy. And then, okay, so. Okay, this is super unorganized. I'm so sorry, guys. I feel a little bit like I'm all over the place. And that is true because we are, in fact, all over the place. But we are getting there. We're having a good time. Seagram starts our next page. Um, Seagram. Mew. Xerneas. I really wish that when they um, did sets, that they designed them to like fill the pages exactly. Cause you know, like when you're putting them in there, in here, they're like they're nine pages, and like usually the see like this, like there's all of these beautiful psychic energies together and then we're gonna but then we have like electric so it's not all purple energy on one page you know what i'm saying like i think that would be really pretty if we were organized like that like a little bit more deliberately for the collection okay I'm trying to get these there okay look we're already looking better we have our Zamazenta goes here. Or like, why not put the Zacian and the Zamazenta together? I don't understand that. Like, they should be side by side. Like, all the rivals, since these aren't really in an order anyway, they should all be, like, next to each other. I'm not complaining. I just think that they could be different. <laughs> all right. Uh, we're just about out of... These guys and I've already lost count, so they all go. Let me just double check before we get too far because I am. These are not numbered, so I have to go off memory. One, two, three. Okay, so I know this is nine. That's nine. 10, 11, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. They all get its 20. So I'm turning the page over here. So the Leo is 21. So that puts Lydia here. This is very much harder without numbers on the cards. Where are they numbered? Oh my gosh, they're numbered, guys. I feel... <laughs> they're numbered. <laughs> what set isn't numbered? There's a set that isn't numbered. I don't remember which one it is, but that that is so funny. I'm just struggle busing for literally no reason when the cards are in fact numbered. Oh, it's the it's like the extra ones. Cause see, like so these ones have the actual celebrations number, and then like all your secret cards are the ones that aren't numbered. Okay, I, I do remember something about this set. I'm not completely crazy, I guess, um, but it could be better, right? So there's. Um, Here's some of our other cards. Let's see what we got. I know we have our Charizard and Blastoise. Do I not have a Venusaur? Oh, that's sad. We didn't quite uh, finish off the big three, at least not right at the top here. So we have our professor's research. I know I saw, there we go. This one here, okay. Then we have the golden U card, which I know I don't have. Then it's going to be a Blastoise. See, or like this. Why not keep the big three all on one page together? Like, that would just look so good to have all three of them right there. 
but it's okay. It's okay. We're we're not complaining. We have the cards that we have. You know, we're doing great. Okay, this is where it starts to get tricky because okay, I have the imposters oak right there because now I have to look at every single one. Okay, it's gonna be Venusaur and then Professor Imposter, Professor Oak. Dark Gyarados, which I don't have. Here comes Team Rocket. And then our little Rocket Zapdos, which is kind of cool. But he's next to Team Rocket. That makes sense. Tracks. Love it. Um, a Pikachu. Birthday Pikachu. I don't think I have. Um, okay, it looks like these are all at least with their duplicates. So we're gonna need you and you and you. I think there were a couple other ones in here that I might have needed, like a Palkia. I know that we needed that one. Flying Pikachu, Surfing Pikachu. Um, honestly, I think that, oh, I definitely need uh, Yeltal. We have a Palkia. There's a Solgaleo. Okay, we'll we'll go back through there again in a second. Let's put some of these back in here. All right, so you go here before the Lugia, and you go here before the Alga. We have our I think surfing Pikachu. You go before Zekrom. Okay, so flying Pikachu. Oh, the Palkia goes here. Okay, look, we have, I think we might have most of the, okay, so I need the other flying Pikachu. That one, and then this one goes here? Yeah, because you're nine. Okay. Okay, okay, we're getting there. Nice, nice. What is what comes after you? Oh, the gold Mew. Yeah, I know I don't have that one. Okay, we're here. I don't think I have any of those, honestly. And okay, clay doll might be the next one. Oh, just kidding. It's gonna be this one first. All right, so this is where we gotta do some counting. We have Zapdos, it's gonna be the Pikachu, Kleefa, Shining Magikarp, Groudon, Rocket Admin. Right here. Another Mew. Where's the Clay Doll? Because you're gonna be after that. So Mew, Gardevoir, Umbreon, Clay Doll, Luxray, Garchomp, Donphan. Oh gosh. <laughs> this is so hard. Okay. We have the Clay Doll, your 15, Noxray, Garchomp, Dogfin, Reshiram. Oh, see, like, these could be next to each other on the page, but they're not. I don't understand why. Okay. Here you go. So Mewtwo, Zerni, Mewtwo, Xerneas, Rayquaza. And then a Tapu Lele, which I'm pretty sure I also don't have. Okay, and then apparently these guys don't actually um, have a spot, but we might still put them in there because I know that they came with the uh, the boxes. Or maybe, this, I don't know, the Zacian was just in with all these. Let me just double check all our doubles here. Oh, look, there's a Garchomp. I think we needed him, right? Uh oh, Rush Ram, we have Kyogre, Palkia, lots of big Pikachus. Wait, did we need those Pikachus? Okay, hold on. We have the flying Pikachu, 
and that surfing Pikachu, and this surfing Pikachu. So we need the other flying Pikachu. Dang it. Okay. <laughs> Cosmo, Cosmoan, Manola. I feel like that had to be a card that we put in here, but okay, yeah. I was, gotta double check. Sassian, for sure, Groudon, Samazenta. Lots of Lugias, Precious Research. Okay, so I think we have everything that we have, and then we just need to find where you live. You live after Claydol. Right here. Right, is that, yes. Okay, I would say math is hard, but we're not actually counting, we're just comparing it to the book, so. Okay, that is our celebration set. Pretty good, almost there, honestly. Just missing a few cards. Well, more of the secret rares, obviously, but uh, I'm pretty happy with that. I mean, that's a really great start. Um, okay, so that will be our last card. So I think we will go ahead and um, we're gonna put our Charizard. Our Pikachu here, and then maybe a Pokeball here, and our other Pikachu right here. Um, and then I don't know, I guess we'll put um, you down here because you got the little number on you, and then this guy, you can also go down here. Kind of hard to do it while they're in that wrapper but i want to keep it sealed because i think that looks nice um yeah i think that's gonna just about do it for our celebrations so i hope you enjoyed that all right thanks for joining me on another episode i am so glad that you stuck around and that you're here to help me build this collection and um, like i said i think i might put the um the mcdonald's cars in here too just because they also have you know the little uh, 25th anniversary kind of theme going um, and then honestly we should have enough space uh, to put this year's in there as well so I'm really excited for all the cards we have and everything that we're going to continue to get so I will see you next time have a wonderful rest of your day and a great week great weekend and I will see you later have a good one bye